Hey there guys, it's Salas, and welcome to Enter the Gungeon. Yeah, I picked this up because this game has had so much positive buzz, and as this is a Salas plays, I am diving into this completely blind. This is actually my first ever attempt at this. All I know is it's a roguelike with a lot of guns. And, okay, we're off to a flying start here. I've got the Marine, the Pilots... The Convict and the Hunter. Right, I think we're going to go with the Marine because... Well, because. So we appear to have a pistol, a helmet, a walkie-talkie and what looks like a gun owner's manual. Right, let's, uh, let's go with the Marine. Okay, we're in. Breach. Okay. This is one of those ones that follows your mouse cursor, which is a novelty. Because a lot of roguelikes are... WAS and D to move. And basically the Binding of Isaac system. WAS and D to move and arrow keys to shoot. But this one follows your mouse cursor. So, I don't know how good I'm going to be at this. And yeah, it's generating. It's all randomly generated. Right. The Halls of Knowledge, Chamber Zero. Oh my god, I can trash the books. Fuck books. I don't want to learn anything. As most of my audience already know, I never learn my lesson. Okay. Now, as you can probably tell from the first from this early on in the game, where would soul approach me and press E to speak? Okay, I will in a bit. But everything is gun based. If you look at the hearts, it's actually two crossed bullets. And a bullet in a shield. I don't know what that does. The key is a bullet with a key thing on the end. And then we've got what looks like a shotgun cartridge. Okay. Fuck the books. Fuck learning. Fuck everything. Actually, that makes me sound like a rapist. Don't fuck everything. Some things don't want to be fucked. Right. Speak to you. For it is I, Sir Manual. Okay. I'll let that one slide since this is a tutorial you are allowed to be called Manual. Heed my words and I shall show you how to survive this accursed labyrinth. Oh my god, we're going to meet David Bowie. Continue through the door to begin your... Did I say tutelage? You don't see many words. You don't see many uses of tutelage. Onward to greatness. Okay. Try flipping these tables. Oh, okay. So it allows me to hide behind the table. That's handy. Although I appear to have scattered what looks like sniper rifle bullets. Yeah, get angry. Okay, fair enough. Excellent. Interacting pupil. Proceed to the next room. There's nothing in any of those, you know, but they they will stop a bullet. Okay, so don't fuck things up. I'm breaking all the rules. Fuck the barrel. Fuck barrels. <laughs> Again, don't fuck barrels. I don't know why I have to make a point of saying that in these videos, but someone is probably going to try and fuck a barrel at some point. This is your most important lesson. Can you dodge roll by pressing right click? Oh my god, I get a Dark Souls roll? You are invulnerable to gunfire during the first half of the dodge roll. Okay. So I've got to get through these lasers by dodge rolling. Right. So. So basically, I've just got to dive. I'm a Premiership footballer! Yes! Check out my mad laser dodging skills. Nice work. Yes, indeed. An impasse. Use your dodge roll to jump over that pit. Dodge! <laughs> Whoops. I, I didn't dodge roll in time. Right. Whoop. There we go. Oh, I've only lost my bullet shield. Okay, so that, that absorbs one damage. Whoop. <laughs> Long dive there. Stretching for it a bit. Right, barrels, 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 fuck them all. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, manual, what are you trying to teach me here? The dodge roll is the first and best way to avoid dying in a gunfight. No shit, Sherlock. Sometimes, though, the number of bullets can be overwhelming. For instance, there's no dodging through that, but there is a way to clear the path. These are called blanks. Okay. Using one will delete all enemy projectiles in a room and stop enemies from shooting for a short period. Okay. That's a nice new mechanic. They will also push nearby enemies away. Great if you need a second to reposition. Pick them up by walking over to them. Boop. Then use them by pressing the Q button. Use a blank to clear the way of bullets and then quickly make it through the gap. Okay. Alright, and Q. Done. Excellent. Blanks refill every floor, so use them when you need to. Okay, fair enough. So I'll get how many per level? They can be found throughout the gungeon, but I wouldn't rely on that. Onward! Can I actually get into the gungeon now? You've got the basic soldier. I suppose you've earned a reward. A gun befitting your stature and experience. Go on, open it. The shitty pistol! <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much my level. Use the mouse to aim and left click to fire. Reload with the R button. No shit. But you'll need something to shoot. One of the gungeon's natural inhabitants. Cruel, savage, and bloodthirsty. Oh my god, they're going to throw a boss at me already? Nope, just a... Is that Bobby the Bullet from American Dad? No, kill him! Oh my god! Listen, listen to the noise that made. Cold-blooded, truly you are ruthless. The next room will be real gunfights. Finally! Kill all the enemies in each room and the doors will open. Okay, that's standard roguelike affair. I'll meet you a few rooms ahead. Now go! And don't forget, you can reload with the armor. If you find another gun, you can switch to it with control. Control, not mouse wheel, really? But listen to this. It's literally a cork gun. Oh, sorry, Bobby the Bullet. Right, real gunfights now. Real gunfights. Ha! <laughs> Suck it, bullets. And suck it, table. No one likes a table. Or a globe, for that matter. Right. Sorry, I keep getting distracted. Oh my god, it's Bobby's. No! Cannot die in the tutorial. I've already lost half a double bullet. I don't want to call it half because it is just a double bullet. Ha! Now give me all the things you dropped, whatever they are. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh my god! The shotgun. The one that's got the shotgun is a shotgun cartridge. Have they themed all the weapons in this game? Whoa, he explodes when he dies. That's not cool. Over here. Wait a minute, I'm doing stuff. I'm destroying things. Is there anything else in this room? Okay, dodge rolling, much like in Dark Souls, is faster than walking. You made it. You know how to dodge roll, shoot, and use blanks. But there's more to learn. Oh, Christ, not more lessons. I'm tired of being in school. You need to know how to use the items that don't exist in gun form. This med kit, for example, it will replenish your health. Pick it up by approaching it and hitting the E button. You still have a bit of fight in you, so you might want to wait to use it. Okay. Whatever you decide to do, remember that the space button uses it. Okay, I'm going to move my thumb away from that. Okay, head through. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to... Uh, I'm not going to use Mr. Medkit just yet. Was that the wind? No, we're underground. See that thing on the other side? That's a teleporter. Okay. Whenever you find one, you can always return as long as you don't... As long as you aren't in combat. Okay. To use it, first open the map by holding tab. 
then click the Oh my god, that's a um that's a revolver chamber. Nice. You wish okay. Then click the revolver symbol you wish to walk to. Got it? Or should I explain it again? Got it. Good. Now use the teleporter to cross the gap. Okay. Boop! There we go! Remember you can warp to any teleporter on the map, not just the ones in the same room. But they won't work if you're in combat. Okay, fair enough. If you press, the, if you press E while standing on that portal, you can use it to teleport back to where you were. I'll be waiting a few rooms north of here. You should explore, try to find a better gun before you challenge the boss. Ah, so the tutorial is actually... Is actually... A thing. A level. That's the word. Level is the word. Right, kill the bobbies. Kill them all. Whoa! I didn't realize he was a grenade. Oh my god, the cover takes damage. That's handy to know. You want to pull some bullshit on me? I'm going to bullshit you right back. Okay, he didn't explode. I'm not used to having a roguelike where I have to reload. That's really weird. Okay, right, we got to try and find a better gun. So we're going to search the gungeon for a gun. You think if anywhere has guns, it would be the gungeon. Right. Right, try and correct choke point. Tactical maneuvering. Oh, what are you? Ah, oh, that's a blank. Okay, I've got two blanks. Fuck up the books. Learnings for losers. And people who like lessons. Okay, there's no door on that side. Sorry, I've got distracted again. Right, that's a teleporter. We don't want to go north because uh, Manuel will be waiting for us. Oh. Oh, fuck. Okay, that blank actually killed them. I'm liking this, actually. I am actually liking this. I mean, the mouse, the mouse aim gives a lot more diversity to your directions rather than, say, your standard roguelike fare. And the fact that it's all real-time combat, because that's one of the things I really hate the most about the uh, everyday... Hello, AK-47! Accept no substitutes. Okay, this one's got a much better fire rate. Let's see how this does. Yeah, as I was saying, I like the fact it's all real-time combat. Which is, oh my god. That's a bullet skull. Awesome. I just, let's just fuck up all this. Fuck the pots up. Zelda taught me to disrespect pots. But I've still got my med kit. Speak with me when you're ready to for your final challenge. Oh my god, it's boss time Boss time, lads. Let's do this. Are you ready to put all you have learned to the test? Yeah, let's fucking do this. Then... Face me in single co- Oh, God! Let's begin! Die! Feel the power of my AK! Everyone's favorite assault rifle. Cease fire, cease fire. Yes, I've unlocked the pea shooter. Okay. You've bested me. I, the great manual. So long have I ruled these halls, only to be undone by the likes of you. The reign of Sir Manuel, master of the gungeon, ends unceremoniously. You've done it. You beat the entire game. Well, that was easy! Leave me here to die again. Come on. Save some of those bullets for Blockner. Okay. 
How about my corks? Fire eat, aren't you? I told you my life story. Aren't you supposed to feel sorry for me? Hell no! You've already won! There's no point in this. Enough! You're just the worst. How many lines of dialogue do they give this guy? The absolute worst animated absolute. Go play the actual game now. Okay, I've exhausted all of his dialogue. Fair enough. Right. Next level. I, I'm back at the start. Oh my god, I could play as a cultist? What the hell? Because I'm now back here. You are now ready to enter the gungeon. Is that all they do? They just... They just block you, you talk to them, and they move. That's a nice touch, actually. Right, let's try an actual level, shall we? Keep of the Lead Lord, Chamber 1. I'm liking the names they've given these levels. That's kind of cool. Oh, I don't have my AK-47 anymore. That sucks. Boo. I've only got my court gun. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, that's not nice. Ow! What the hell was that? Oh, God, this is more tense than the tutorial. Of course it is, you fool. Oh, this is an infinite gun. Okay, noted. Whatever this gun is, it's infinite. Uh, it's, it's, just, it's just ruin all this stuff. Right, I've only lost half a bullet, so I'm okay. Fire the infinite weapon! Okay, so it does have to reload. It just uh, has infinite ammo. Okay, noted. I mean, I've got to say, I love the fact that every single one of these enemies is some form of bullet. Slash shell. Slash cartridge. Slash whatever you want to fucking call these. That is definitely a shotgun cartridge. There is no mistaking what that is. Whoa, 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 you nasty little bastard. Okay, he's got an AK-47. That's not cool. That's not cool. That's not cool. And they teleport. Noted. Give me all of your things. Right, teleporter active. Let's go. Let's go this way. What the hell is that? I do not recognize what kind of gun you are from. And now you're dead. Right, I've got to keep an eye out for chests and such. Let's reload my infinite weapon. I'm now calling this gun. I'm now calling this run officially Operation Infinite Weapon. Hello, what's this? Table of Tech Rage. Flips of Fury. I like the fact that uh, as as well as giving you all this like cool stuff. It does the uh, Binding of Isaac ast Afterbirth thing. Where it kind of tells you what it does. But not in a direct way. Kill Bobby! Okay, what kind of gun has a firing pattern like that? Well, maybe the Puckle Gun, because that is a square bullet. If you don't know what the Puckle Gun is, look it up. I'm not going to go into explanation. All I'm going to say is that nowadays a weapon like that would be considered hilariously racist. 
or at least what it was designed for would be considered hilariously racist. Right, back this way. Oh, fuck. I haven't got a health kit either, I need to find one. Whoa! Thought you were being fucking clever, did you? Gonna have to find another gun. Gonna have to find another gun. I don't feel confident taking on any kind of boss with just my infinite weapon. Okay, this is the worst game of Norton bosses ever. Right, he's down. And Bobby's down. I love the persistent corpses as well. I just like wading through the corpses of my enemies in all games. Oh, blue shotgun cartridges. What the hell do you do? Are you like those blue bastards in the tutorial where you can just teleport at will? Or do you have to walk like the red ones? Or are you just a reskin? Who can tell? Aiming while under pressure is really hard. Oh, that's just a bobby I can do it. What the hell? Not cool, not cool. Oh, every time I flip a table, I get a rage boost. That's what flips of rage does. Teleporter active. Nice. I'm down to one heart. This isn't good. What's the radio do? Do I have a radio for help? I don't know. We'll find out if I'm in trouble again. Right, rage boost. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm getting the hang of this. Slowly. Slowly. But I'm down to half a heart. This is this is, might be the end of it. Oh, I've got to find a fucking key. Right, see what happens if we use the radio. Nothing. I can't do anything. I am the worst marine. Okay, maybe... Do I, sh do I just shoot the lock off? This is a heavily gun-based game. Yes, you do. You just shoot the lock off. What's that? Junk. Next time, use a key. Oh, you twat! Oh, that is... That is just wonderful. Right. I like that. That was quite a funny joke. I thought, this game's heavily gun-based. Let's try doing that. Nope. Turns out if you shoot the lock off a chest, it just turns out it contents into junk. I've got half a heart. Let's end the video by checking out the first floor boss. What could possibly go wrong? And so there's shit if I know. Okay, that doesn't look like a fun gun. Nice intro though. Oh shit, it's a giant bird. That is one badass bird. Rapid fire, raptor, gatling, <laughs> whatever it was, I couldn't read it in time. Alright, get me, some, get me a rage boost first. Oh shit, what's it doing? Okay, so it attacks from the sky. Well, that kind of makes sense, it is a fuck! Ingbird. Well, I'm dead. I was only using the pea shooter though. Has you died? Pea shooter has joined the shootout. Okay. The microtransaction gun. Oh, EA would be so proud. Yeah, I was killed by an explosion. It actually tells you what killed you as well. <laughs> Yeah, I can see me playing a lot more of this game, and if you haven't got it already, I would recommend you go out and get it, because it's cute, yet very sinister at the same time. 
it's fun and challenging. And with the random generation these these types of games usually use, you've got almost infinite replay value. Go ahead and get this game. It is amazing. So thank you all for watching. And until our next little dive into games I haven't touched yet, I've been Salas. I'm going to re-enter the gungeon, and I will see you next time.